on and get your sign. Come on and get your sign. Buddy's girlfriend pulled up on him in the gym. If he was actually exercising, this situation probably could have been avoided. She just stood over him as he did whatever on his phone, hopefully it wasn't bad. I swear he'd been sitting for at least 10 minutes on the machine. I wanted to help him but I was training a client. Almost the whole gym was watching, waiting for him to notice. When she left, we told him that whatever you did on that phone for the last 15 minutes, she saw it buddy. He ran out after her, and I haven't seen him in the gym since this was in January. Yeah, buddy ain't with old girl no more. But you know what? There's a good chance that he could still be with her. They could still very well be together. Because somebody that goes out their way that much to sit over you, first off, I don't know how he can't recognize that somebody ain't behind him for that long. Like your senses don't kick off or something like that. You didn't look back or anything. Okay, that's a whole nother story. But Back to what I was saying, I'm willing to bet that they probably are still together. There's a good chance because somebody that goes out that far to be with you is crazy. Um, that's like a man pulling up on a woman at Victoria's Secret knowing that that's where that woman's going to be. That's like a man pulling up on a woman at a beauty supply store knowing that's where that woman's going to be. Um, yeah, he wasn't working out at that time. Um, but I'm sure that he didn't just walk up in there not to work out at all. Now, I'm not saying, you know, it's obvious that the brother did something and he looks like that he's all caught up. I am not um, pushing that to the side. The boy, you know, the home home boy don't got caught up. It is what it is. The relationship looked like it's over. But I, you know, yeah, she was calm about it as far as how she reacted in the moment because she didn't want to get caught. But let's just say she pulled up on old boy and was, you know, to, his, to the gym, same thing what she did. Uh, sat behind him and then realized that, that you know that he was actually being productive except for he was just scrolling on Instagram or you know looking on YouTube or something like that. Then what? What if he would have turned around and then and then spotted her at at in that very moment saying, What the heck are you doing? What the hell are you doing? Oh well, you know, I just had to see if you were cheating. Oh, gone. They don't belong together. Uh that's just as as bad as looking through somebody's phone. Now I'm gonna be a little realistic, okay? Nobody should be going out of their way to go look at somebody's phone. I actually feel like if you got to build up your mind to do that, then there's a good chance that you probably don't need to be in a relationship no more because you need to one, work on yourself, and two, uh, it means that you don't trust that person. But I can kind of see it every now and then, you know, you might get a little glimpse or just to try to see, you know, you might have hit it, you might just not be hitting it off with somebody to see if, you know, they clean. I understand that. I'm not saying it's right. But usually, you know, there's some sort of way that people need to get some type of clarity. And sometimes, and a lot of times when you're with somebody, just looking at them and dealing with them every day and sleeping in the bed with them and doing what you do and going out and feeling good and having fun, that's not enough. Sometimes you have to get that mm, And uh, like, like I said, I'm not saying it's right, but she's a clear, crazy, probably might be a psychopath. Um, just for a woman to go to a whole gym and stand behind a man for 15 doggone minutes, you, oh yeah, it was probably best that they broke that thing on off. Uh, that's a clear sign for her and him. What she did was, she didn't really spot nothing that, you know, the average woman have not really dealt with, which is knowing that a man is going to be on his phone probably doing some things that, you know, or maybe liking pictures or doing stuff that he would normally do around you. Um, you know, women do it too, but I'm not going to put that on them. But 
But the fact that she went out her way, I mean, got in the car, maybe had the gas up, maybe turned on the radio, turned on the, the, the map request, uh, parked the car, looked around your surrounding, you tiptoed up in there and spotted the man, stood over him, God, dog. Oh yeah, that's not somebody who I would wanna be with, not at all. Um, grown people gonna be grown people and you don't own nobody. And that's that, okay? So that was berserks to me, uh, real berserks. Like I said, there's plenty of people that's gonna be looking at the video saying, well, I don't care, you know, he's a cheating dog and all this other stuff. Okay, what else is new? What else is new? Damn near all y'all got cheated on before or did the cheating. And y'all have, uh, more, more than half of y'all out here talking about how dudes be cheating. Well, who the hell they doing it with? Unless it's with another man. God damn, they got to be participating and y'all got to be part participating with them in some, it, to some degree. So, over by, oh, I would say damn near about half of y'all chicks that be watching this video done participated in a cheating act. Knowing that damn well it's like, ah, uh, okay, but I'm not going to put my flowers out there. We're going to talk about this dirt and trying to find a way to support this woman as if she's doing right. How the f is she doing right? Standing over a nigga and stalking him. Ha! Y'all better make this make sense. She crazy. She crazy. Oh, and another thing too. And if she keep doing that, she gonna forever remain single. So, she actually put herself out on blast by doing that because now it might be other dudes that might spot that video and be like, whoa, let me go ahead and dodge this bullet. Not because I'm a cheater, but no, 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 no. No faithful man wants, don't even want a woman like that. Not a woman that does that. No. Let's just say there's a man out here that ain't doing nothing. You think that man want her? Make it make sense.